Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. For today's video, I'm going to do you guys a little clothes haul. It seems that clothes shopping is my moving out to uni coping mechanism of choice. I have done a fair bit of shopping recently. I've actually found a lot in H&M. I also have, of course, some bits from ASOS to show you guys. I'm actually going to start with ASOS because there's a couple of things in here which I'm just obsessed with. The first thing being my first ever pair of cargo trousers. I don't know why I did not buy a pair of cargo sooner. They've got a little button here and then obviously they've got the cargo pocket on the side. We've also got pockets on the back and at the front as well which is very unheard of for women's clothing. I love these. They are so comfortable. I can't really explain the material. They fit so nicely and they will just go with it anything. It seems I went a little bit knitwear crazy. I picked up three different knitted jumpers. The first one is this green jumper which I love. I've worn this two times already. It is in this green colour which I really like. I feel like pastels are actually going to be quite in this autumn. Recently I've been really trying to add colour to my wardrobe and muted colours like this have been my favourite. It's a v-neck jumper, it's got a really nice little neckline detailing. It's on the sleeves it has this exposed seam, but I could just add something to the jumper and then obviously around the wrists as well you've got cuffing. I can't describe how soft this jumper is. I've been actually wearing this with those cargos which I just showed you and I really like how that outfit has been looking. Haven't washed it yet though and I don't know how that's gonna go. Then I fell down the collared jumper route. First one I picked up is this beautiful white one. This is I would say a chunkier knit. You've got the collar detailing which I really really like. Then it flows down to the arms where you've got collaring as well. These arms are much bigger. It's a very oversized kind of jumper. I feel like white jumpers in autumn are just a staple. You can pair it with anything. Black jeans, blue jeans, joggers. It's so soft. I cannot wait to wear this out and about. You know when you find something and you just really like it and then you buy it in those different colours? May or may not have done that because I also bought that jumper in this really beautiful purple colour. I don't really own many purple things in my wardrobe but again it's just like a muted colour which I think works really well for autumn and this will also be okay in spring. This is literally the exact same. It's again a sort of design. It's got the same collar detailing. I really like this. You might be able to tell better up close but there's actually a few different colours running through here. We've got like some different shades of purple and some white as well. Love it. Imagine me wearing this in a freaking lecture hall. A little interruption from the knitwear to show you guys some earrings which I ordered. I got this set of two pairs of earrings. They're sort of like a rounded rectangle kind of shape. I actually have one super similar to this in right now but I actually bought this set for the bigger ones because I did have some bigger ones but they've actually broken. Next up I got a little cardigan. I thought this would be really good for layering or just wearing on its own. It's in this really pretty creamy brown colour. This feels so so soft. It has one button at the front which I really like. Obviously if you wear it just as a top you'll see a bit more skin and then if you wear it with a little like tank top underneath you can just sort of like layer it. I think this would actually look really lovely with the cargo. Something I was looking for on ASOS was some going out tops because I feel like my going out wardrobe is very limited. Honestly I wasn't all that successful but I did come across this top which I think could be dressed up or dressed down. It's really really hard to show but it's one of those tops that has a collar and then has some buttons and then an open bit at the bottom. Originally I bought this to wear with some pinstripe trousers. I actually ordered those from Bershka as well but when they arrived I really did not like the colour. I actually just ended up sending those back but I'm definitely still on the lookout for some pinstripe trousers and I feel like this would match really well with those. One of my best friends actually inspired me to get this next thing. I have finally caved and bought a pair of flared black leggings. They're kind of in a sports leggings material. I've always just felt like flares won't look right on me but they're actually just so comfortable and I feel like with a hoodie or something this is like a super chill around campus or to lecture outfit. These ones are actually from Collusion. I just really needed some new trousers because I really just have like two pairs of jeans and that's it. So as you can see I've got a couple more options in this haul. Next up I actually got a pair of shorts. I think I'm gonna wear these as pajamas. They're little cream shorts. They've got a drawstring and like a really nice elasticated waistband so they're 
they're super comfy and they're ribbed and they've got these little blue flowers on them the last thing i got from asos was actually a sweater vest and it is just this blue cobalt knitted sweater vest it is a little bit big but it was in the sale for eight pounds i think and i just think sweater vests are so versatile they work in so many different seasons and they're a really great wardrobe transitional piece they're seven pounds like i can't really complain and i'm gonna show you what i got from h&m this is actually accumulated over like four different trips first of all i got a couple hoodies this is to expand my comfy wardrobe first one's a little bit dirty because i have been wearing it for the last like week straight so i do apologize this is a hoodie from the men's section it's in this really lovely creamy accru color on the front it just says in blue stay in slow motion and then on the back it has this big design as well which says stay in slow motion escalate in space okay i like the blue and this color together it's such a soft hoodie something about the men's section in h&m just hits different their hoodies are softer then i got a cobalt blue hoodie i have really been trying to find some more hoodies that are colored because i feel like every hoodie i own is black or gray i got this in a size small because it said oversized on the website if anything i kind of wish it was a little bit bigger but the color is so cute and this will go with so many different things i got a couple super basic white tops the first one is this little tank top this is very brandy melville it's got lace around all the edges and a little bow on the front which is so sweet this will just be again great for like a base layer of layering an outfit or good on its own or under a hoodie and then h&m have very much ripped off urban with these tops but i saw this one on h&m in this creamy color it is essentially the exact same it's got the lace going across and underneath the top part of the top and then it's ribs even got adjustable straps and this was only 9.99 so the price difference is a lot this will just be so easy to style and i could even dress it up for a night out or dress it down for like a chill day so when i was in store the other day i came across this scarf and let me tell you i'm obsessed it was 9.99 it's in this beautiful like creamy color which you've seen a lot of in this haul today it has these tassels it's so soft i can't wait to like snuggle up in this when i'm walking around campus but also it's quite a nice length so i can wear it a bunch of different ways finally i have a couple bits from h&m which i am obsessed with but i need tips on how to style so please help me out in the comments first is this beautiful chunky roll neck cable knit sweater vest i love this i love a sweater vest i love the color of this everything about it i love apart from maybe the roll neck maybe i do not suit a roll neck i'm also completely undecided on whether it looks best without anything underneath or does it look better with a shirt underneath how am i supposed to wear it i don't know i also got this beautiful shirt in cobalt blue i am obsessed with this it's literally just like a plain basic shirt it's got a pocket on the front buttons going down but again i don't really know how to style this is it best open over another top should i wear it with blue jeans because that's a lot of blue but then i don't really like how it looks with black jeans how do i style this i really need advice my favorite way i've found to wear it so far is done up and then like half tucked in into some blue jeans let me know what you guys think in the comments that is everything that i've bought for my uni wardrobe so far i've had so much fun shopping for all these bits have spent a little bit too much money but retail therapy let me know if you end up picking up any of these pieces all the links will be in the description box down below if you did enjoy this video please do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below and i will see you very soon for a brand new video bye